I want to take a quick minute to show you one of my favorite new features in On One Photo Raw. So if you currently use effects in an earlier version, you're going to love this one. First, let me show you how this works in an older version of effects. I'm going to stack a couple of filters. First, I'll add a tone enhancer. Then maybe some dynamic contrast. And finally, black and white. So you can see the stack of the three filters. Now, let's say I want to go back and adjust just the tone enhancer. As soon as I click on it, the filters above it get turned off. So I lose the context of the whole stack when I make an adjustment. And I have to adjust, then turn off the other filters, and then turn them back on. And if I don't like my adjustment, I may have to repeat that whole process. And it's the same if I wanted to mask a filter too. Now, let me show you how it works inside of Odd One Photo Raw. I'm actually going to start in the develop module first and adjust the tone there instead of effects. Then I'll go to effects and I'll add some dynamic contrast, maybe a black and white filter. Now, let's say I want to adjust just the dynamic contrast. Notice when I select it in the stack, the black and white is still on. And as I adjust the dynamic contrast, I see it adjusts through the black and white filter. But it goes beyond just effects. You can go back to develop and make adjustments and still see all of your work above it in effects. There's also some common tools between develop and effects like the perfect eraser. So I can go out and I can retouch distractions wherever I see them, like this road in the foreground. You gotta hate when they just put random roads everywhere. But I can also mask in the middle of my stack. So let's say I wanna remove that dynamic contrast from the clouds. I can use the masking brush, paint it away, and I can still see my results from the black and white. This makes for a much smoother, more natural editing experience where I don't have to remember where I made my adjustments or switch modules to use some of the different common tools. And I really think you're going to love this new feature.